Hi guys, welcome back to our channel, Life with York Palace. My name is Cynthia. So today I'm gonna to be showing you what I pack in my hospital bag for baby number four. <laughs> yeah, so this is gonna be just like a minimal um, things that I absolutely need in the hospital. I don't wanna carry like any extra stuff. So I'm gonna be showing you guys what I pack um, in this um, cute bag right here. Uh, for this bag, I'm gonna be linking two um bags um that kind of uh, that kind of looks like this that also have the same storage space and everything like that um those ones they have like this pop of color um that i i'm pretty sure you moms out there are gonna love but this one was just is just like one color kind of bag um i bought it like um a really long time ago before i discovered you know those two new bags so i'm going to be linking those two below um if you want to check it out so i'm going to be packing in the baby's um things first and i'm going to be showing you what i'm putting inside here um okay so first off i'm going to be packing the good old wipes <laughs> um i know you know the hospital also gives like um wipes and diapers and stuff like that but just in case you know um they're not going to be giving out any of those wipes and diapers i'm just going to be bringing my own and if i don't use it in the hospital hey i can bring it back and use it at home um so i'm putting that in here and also i have this um newborn um diaper i'm just you know just taking like a handful of them because i also know you know the hospital is going to supply some of these um diapers as well um but in the event they do not so i just have to have some handy um so i'm also going to be packing that in here and these guys these are um swaddling blankets to use to cover the baby once the baby comes out i know the um, standard hospital one has the white and blue colors there i mean those colors are so boring <laughs> um i'm gonna be using this for the baby when bringing the baby back home but yeah the baby can use the hospital one at the hospital so i'm just packing mine and again guys i'm gonna be leaving some of these links below um in case you guys want to see or check out um where i got them from um also i'm gonna be packing um two beeps two burp clothes um you know you never know when you're gonna need them so i'm gonna be throwing them inside here and i also love the design here and <laughs> this one says i may be small but i'm the boss <laughs> that's kind of funny um okay i'm gonna be putting that in here and also coming on to the good stuff the baby's um onesie this one is um zero to three months of course um you know we're gonna i'm gonna be having this baby during winter well during cold season so i'm 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 gonna have to dress the baby in this first before wearing the overall so that you know the baby don't feel you know too cold um so i'm just gonna pack it like this and you know the colors here too are also really vibrant and um i just you know i just love um pop of palmos okay so this is the baby's onesies this is the two outfits i'm going to be packing for her um during her stay in the hospital um this one is just all white kind of um onesie and i really really love it love it because it also has um this kind of like glove that you can use and cover the baby's hands as well um if you don't want to you know pack um glove with you um so i'm just gonna fold it and put it in here yeah guys it's all coming together and actually i'm getting by tomorrow i'm gonna be um 37 weeks so i'm just trying to pack early on you know in case anything happens next week next two weeks so i know that i'm fully prepared for it now these are the baby's um hats so i'm just taking everything yeah the ones i don't use i bring it back <laughs> i just want to have you know that choice of you know when i wake up in the morning oh a stretch oh okay let's look into this and see what i want to just wear for this child this day and i also really love this because it comes with like matching hand gloves like you can see for this one it matches with this cap right here so you can't go wrong with matching sets i would highly highly encourage you you know to check out this link if when i once i link it um below this video 
so you can just you know take a look at it you want your baby to be coordinated fashion you know and all those good stuff <laughs> all right so i'm gonna be throwing inside here all right guys so i'm not gonna be opening this but you can you guys can see the color of this this is what she's gonna be wearing to come home um once we get discharged from the hospital so keep an eye out for that because we're going to be shooting a video um in terms of that um pretty soon so you're going to see the full outfit so no i'm not going to show you this this is a little secret so it's still inside the box i'm going to be throwing that in and this is the sock she's going to be wearing with that outfit this tiny <laughs> tiny sock all right guys so that is all for the baby what i'm going to be needing for the baby just the absolute necessary things the remaining things in the event i need it the hospital is always going to supply that but this is what you know your child will really need in the hospital now going over to what i'm going to be wearing or what i'm going to need um in the hospital of course we're going to need um nursing bra i mean if you are breastfeeding um, if you choose to breastfeed, nursing bra is, you know, an absolutely mo an, a, an absolute must. Um, I got these um, uh, at Amazon that are really, really soft, guys, and they come in like multiple colors. Um, and I'm also going to be linking this below in case you guys, you know, want to check it out. Um, you can see it's very, um, it feels so soft and, you know, you can open it, put it down, breastfeed. And those good stuff so i'm going to be packing two of this um since we're going to be staying in the hospital for you know not too long anyways um so i'm going to be packing two of this just right here and i'm going to be throwing everything to inside this one diaper bag because i think there should be enough space for everything um next i'm also packing this um shoe of course i'm not going to use my bare legs <laughs> to walk um the hospital floor so if you want you can pack something soft you know any slippers you have should i mean should suffice um so but this is what i'm going to be packing just this black um, um slippers here uh, and again i also bought it from amazon um the link will be in the description box as well some cozy sock for those cold feet you know when you're lying down in the bed even though you're covered sometimes but you can still feel some cold on your feet the, i mean sock is just an absolute must the last time i went for to the hospital i think i forgot my sock so my leg my feet were just so exposed and i was so cold um so now i'm not gonna forget this um so i'm putting that in here and these guys this is um nipple cream so you know at the early stages when you start breastfeeding you know you're gonna get some like cracks i mean it doesn't happen for everybody um but my own the two times i breastfed i got like these sore cracks um on the nipple area so i'm just trying out this i've never used it before but i'm gonna um, start using it for this pregnancy then i might come back later and kind of like give you the review of how it works um but yeah i'm also gonna be packing this for those first few days now to the clothes um i'm just gonna i'm packing just this overall um kind of like pajamas kind of um gown um because i don't want anything tight you know after you deliver you just want something that is just so, so free and this is very soft it's just like onesie just put it on and you know continue breastfeeding or relaxing or you know getting your proper um recovery that you deserve so this is um i bought this in two colors this is kind of like grayish black and i also got one um in this black color so i'm gonna pack um two of this uh, for my two day stay at the hospital um so i also got this on amazon i'm gonna be putting the link below in case you guys want to check it out um yeah and this one too and it also comes with like with a matching um belt so it's really really nice and it's also really breastfeeding friendly so if you want to check it out is gonna be really really good so those are the things i'm gonna need 
my sock, my slippers, no simbra. And also guys, um, I'm also gonna be packing um, my no sim pad. Yeah, you can see it's a bunch of it. Um, I think this is um, 200 pieces. So I'm gonna be packing, taking out some here, maybe a couple of pieces uh, for those first few days at the hospital um, so that, you know, when breast milk leaks, you know, it can just like flow inside here. Um, so I'm gonna be packing this also inside here. So those are the basic things you need, guys. So other accessories you might need um, that I'm also gonna be packing later on is like, um, your extra long charger, you know, um, you don't want, you know, after birth, you wanna go on your social media, you wanna like snap photos of your newborn. You wanna make sure that, you know, your battery is well um, fully charged. So I'm gonna be carrying this very long um, charger with me. And I'm also gonna be packing some snacks. Um, so that one I'm gonna be planning maybe like next week, next two weeks, um, buying some snacks because, you know, hospital food, like, hey, where is that one gonna reach? So you wanna start, you know, mumbling on some things, some things that you bring um, from home. And also guys, absolutely necessary. And I'm also gonna be packing that one maybe at the time of my, before I leave the house for labor, um, and delivery. I'm gonna be packing my toiletries, like my um, toothbrush, toothpaste, towel, you know, I mean, that one has to, you, you have to pack that um, as well. So I'm gonna be packing that. It's just gonna be like a quick, like taking it on that day off. So I'm gonna be packing that as well. All right, guys, so let me know what you think. Let me know what you, pack, what you packed or what you will pack in your hospital bag down in the comment below let me know if i'm forgetting anything or let me know something that's going to be very useful to me that i'm not thinking about yet for um, my hospital um, parking and guys you know pray for us for a safe and smooth um, labor because it's going to be coming up like in a couple of weeks from now um, and thank you guys for watching this video today as always please um, like subscribe turn on the notification bell you know the bell that looks like a bell <laughs> down here so that you guys can know anytime we post new vo videos which we do every week so once again guys let me know in the comment section below what you think and share this video to other moms who are kind of like in the process last, last trimester and things like that but until next time guys see ya bye